वेलकम टू माई ट्रैवल ब्लॉग्स I hope you like this video and if you do don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like these don't forget to hit on that bell next to where you have hit on subscription so that you will be notified whenever I make a video and I make videos for you so you should be clicking on that bell Let me take you through the property and the room tour. The Trident in Jaipur is a modern pleasant hotel with super friendly and professional staff. My check-in was very fast, no hassles at all. The location also was at the right place. They have a kids club which has many activities for the kids. There is so much greenery in this property. It is so peaceful actually. It's a vast property. So good for relaxing. I would highly recommend this property if you just want to relax for 2 to 3 days. The location is at the right place as I said before because everything is quite nearby if you just want to go for a day sighting as such. The Amir Fort, everything is quite near. So I would highly recommend it again. The room was really luxurious and spacious. I really liked it. As for the toiletries, it was well equipped. I just had one issue is the spray next to the toilet was on the left side I mean who the hell keeps it on the left side it should be on the right side because it's very difficult to clean otherwise <laughs> My room is seriously messed up because this is actually day 2 where I'm showing the room tour because day 1 I was very tired. So, it's messed up but I'm trying to be a little neat for my babies. They have a jewelry store, they have a souvenir store. Just have a look at it if you're staying here. They have an amazing exceptional restaurant which I will be taking you in sometime. The swimming pool is just in front of the lobby which I don't prefer personally. So let's take you to the gym a well equipped gym is what i look for and this has it all and they even have a spa room Hello my super babies I am in Jaipur and yeah I am in a new place before the year ends I am so excited and um, 
Okay, I'm in Trident. Now I'm here for lunch. So let's see what I'm going to eat. So I've ordered for sparkling water, room temperature, sea kebab, lamb in lamb, and uh, lal mas and garlic and garlic naan. I'm not too hungry, but. Dig into it. Hmm, a little bit spicy. This is like the spiciest kebab I've ever had. It's really melt in the mouth, but super spicy. So let's try the garlic naan, this is lal mas, this is uh, dal of the day and this is sabji of the day. Let's see. Sabji of the day first. Mm. Very hot. But I really like this masala. Hmm. I really like it. Now, lalmas. Hmm. Let's try the dal. Simple. The garlic one is really tasty. Very tasty food. I love the vegetarian sabji of the day, potatoes and dhania, then the dal, the lal mas, everything was right, super lunch. I'm so stuffed babies, I mean the food is really really good and I'm sleepy now, let's see, no oh, sauce is running. Because it's really spicy. Hello my super babies. After lunch, I went to sleep dead. And now, it's time to look around. Let's see. So now I've come for the light and sound show at the Amir Fort. So let's see. Unfortunately, photography was not allowed inside, but many were happily recording and clicking pictures. I think they should be a little strict when they've kept rules. Someone should actually take a look while it's going on. Otherwise, perfecto. I love this light and sound show.
for malai chicken, jeera rice and kadi. Apart from the jeera rice, nothing else was tasty. I wouldn't recommend this restaurant and yes, it's not worth it. Now going back to the room, the food was just about okay. Mm, I really didn't like the food. But for that music and dance, that hotel is a super bad food. Pwak. Good morning my super babies. This is day 2. I couldn't record yesterday night much because I ate dinner and I did a shoot for my nighttime skincare routine. If you haven't watched it, just check it. It's the previous one of the videos I put in the description box. And then that's all. And I went to sleep. I had to edit it out, upload it, everything. So yeah. This place was actually just too too good. Unfortunately recording was not allowed inside. But this place had too many good things. Super duper bangles, bed sheets, kurtas, bandhani and I spent good 3 hours here. Now it's time for lunch. So I just got done with Rajasthan Arts and Crafts Cottage Industry and that place is really really nice. Photography inside was prohibited. I asked a lot but no use because I don't know but that place is really worth going. I did a lot of shopping and uh, I will do a haul soon. I guess I should do because okay one of them is this and it's so pretty Kundan and there's a lot of other stuff. Now, now I'm up for lunch and let's see what I'm going to afford it for one vegetarian dish, one lal mas and the bajra ki roti. I'm really happy today because I feel I've really bought something really nice. This place is really nice. It's a government shop and uh, yeah. The food out here was outstanding. I visited here twice and it is really really tasty. The bajra ki roti with pure ghee was like yummy. Let's see how it is. Bajra ka roti is really nice. Try the vegetarian stuff. Ah, very hot. Mm. Let's try the mutton, lal mas. The veg gatte is really, really tasty. I really love it. The gatte ki sabji and the bajra ka roti is too good, man. I really love it. Really tasty. back to the room and I've ordered for chocolate Marcos it's supposed to be very tasty signature dessert out here with hot chocolate which has a lot of spices in it and yes it was really delicious so let's see how this tastes it's supposed to be spicy it's supposed to be sweet anything spicy till now let's see I think spicy it's just like a nice rich chocolate mousse but it's yum <coughs> the chocolate I mean the spice is in this it's in the chocolate sauce because I was just licking it and I literally got choked because I could feel it really spicy something different so my super babies, after lunch I just came back home and yeah, I got a new ring. Uh, there was this astrologer in the previous Rajasthan craft and all that and 
he suggested me this ring and I spent a lot of money and I bought it. But yeah, no other option. I really felt like using it. So now I'm going to Choki Dani. To begin with, it was extremely crowded. There's a lot of activities inside. It's quite a good place for like a night out or something like that. But for me personally, I wouldn't recommend it because the food was hideous. time for dinner and I chose the wedge Rajasthani Thali uh, there's nothing exclusive about it it was just about I don't want to criticize it much but yes I end my vlog right here and I hope you enjoyed it a simple vlog this is bye bye